Hello everyone, I'm Yang Yuchi and Professor Yang, um, National Gangshan University of Science and Technology in Taiwan. And uh, today I would like to share the topic, we are so-called uh, business model and the performance of a commercial port time with its own. Uh, this is our content. First one is the introduction to commercial port with its own. And uh, number two, advantage of commercial port with its own. And uh, number three is a uh, business model of commercial port with its own. Number four is a uh, performance of uh, commercial port with its own. Uh, this is uh, my uh, personal uh, profile, uh, including uh, um, I'm professor of National Gaoshan University and the science and technology in Taiwan and I got a degree from the Jiang University in Korea. Okay, first one, uh, like the introduction to the commercial poor uh, free day zone. Uh, the Taiwan government have uh, set up some head of establishment and management of free day zone in 2003. So, uh, the function of uh, free trade zone are intended to encourage some private company to use some uh, very tax and duty incentive uh, to be export or transcendent uh, the Congo with the variant. So let me attract more uh, foreign um, or domestic enterprise to invest their uh, factory or some office in this area. And you can see the our um, basically this kind of uh, free trade zone they have uh, uh, followed the slogan of a change of 2008, how to privatize uh, the development project of the nation, and also they have some uh, um, incentive over for the tenant company, and the list free trade zone. For example, they have a good to be transport from overseas to the free trade zone and. Uh, uh, machining the link and requirement to be transported from OSC into free zone and so on. Okay, the our uh, list of free zone their end is uh, developing the, the models of uh, operation for global logistic and management system. Basically, it's, uh, because the new by the seaport, they focus not only is uh, just the logistic service only. Also, they have to uh, tr uh, track some uh, simple processing manufacturing in this area. So number two, effectively aggressive promotion of trade liberalization and uh, international. International. Of course, uh, number three is uh, uh, facilitating the smooth flow and personal and good finance and technology. Okay, uh, basically we have set up the, our uh, almost a seven, seven, um, seven. Um, like um, uh, for example, we have a Kilompo FTC set up in two thousand four, Kaohsiung FTC, Taichung FTC uh, set up the two thousand five, and also we have a uh, uh, Shuapo FTC two thousand ten, Taipei Po two thousand twelve, Anping Po set up the is. Uh, uh, 2013. Also, we have uh, another uh, final one, seven of uh, FTZ, that means uh, in nearby the Taoyuan uh, International Airport FTZ. Okay, you can see this, uh, this is our, our uh, uh, FTZ, so they have a location. And you can see the FTZ location, uh, special, uh, our kind of east side, uh, that means the, including the kilo and uh, so on. And the uh, west side, uh, they have uh, some Taipei port and uh, some, uh, for example, the Guilin port, they have uh, focus on the small and the light uh, products and 3C three, three government and uh, some compact uh, production. And the Taipei port uh, is, uh, uh, is focused on the, some automotives, that means uh, special for the car. They have some part uh, uh, assembly and uh, some logistics center in here, and also they have some air and sea multi model transport, 
and Coaching's Rojisti, and uh, here is Taizhou. Taizhou means uh, center, our uh, center part of location in in the uh, in here, uh, and also they have Anping Po nearby Tainan, and Kaohsiung Ko uh, focus on the major container transit hub, and uh, multi country con cargo consolidation, and RAE delivery port. Okay, here's a Burview Met. Uh, it's uh, located on the uh, Kilom. Um, it's a uh, northeast um, uh, Taiwan, and here is the West Bank area, and this is uh, East Bank area. Uh, here's a sh just show you the map about the uh, uh, oh, So far, we have uh, six terminal. Uh, majority will be uh, uh, destined belong to the free trade zone here. The terminals one, terminal two, terminal three, four, five, six, and uh, and uh, maybe next year will be terminal seven. Okay, uh, here is uh, talking about some our uh, advantage of a commercial port for the zone. Uh, basically, they they have six niche, including the uh, overly tax uh, uh, presentation and uh, of normal management. Uh, tax less means uh, they can free of the tax, including the uh, commodity tax, business tax, the tobacco, and the tax, and so on. Uh, the normal manager is belong to the custom authority to recognize their system. That means uh, they can cargo query automation, and also they can use the electronic book and storage space control. Another one is uh, inside of border, but outside the customer, uh, no bound by the provision of uh, import and export regulation. And then, uh, another one is uh, number four, the number four niche, um, one stop administration service. That means you can use this kind of uh, one stop service to apply for anything, and also they can get some consultant. Uh, maybe suggestion from the government. Here is a uh, very else process. Uh, in this area, not just only storage some cargo, or do some very ex um, logistics uh, activity, and also including the, some our uh, simple um, uh, manufacturing in this area. Uh, free circulation of goods. So you can use use Asian or uh, this uh, free trade zone area. To do some uh, examination and the free, uh, so do some inspection, tax, and so on in this uh, area. Okay, this is uh, number three talking about business model. Uh, actually, so far they have a different kind of uh, business model in here. Uh, first one, uh, uh, Kilong, Taipei, or Taichung, or um, Kaohsiung, uh, because uh, you know, um, Normally, the uh, seaport they are hindered and very small. And that's very big. So that means uh, they are, are special for the offer the space for the storage quite very small. So if your uh, your cargo needs needs, uh, for example, to in import from the uh, mainly China or Vietnam, uh, use this cargo, and because uh, this cargo have been to uh, reassembly or some do some man simple manufacturing and uh, to become the finished good. You can use the, uh, the port, nearby the port, they have neighboring space. Neighboring uh, area, including the uh, industry park, and uh, side park, and export proceeding zone, and uh, playing in tax area. Uh, you, you, you can do uh, this, this kind of resembling and then uh, when you finish the uh, processing the process or, or or assembly process, and then uh, become the finished good, the export to another country. Okay, here is a uh, uh, bit on the case of um, uh, Taipei port. Uh, autonomous beer um, uh, assembly case in commercial port because uh, in Taipei port uh, we will import some a lot of some car park uh, for from the uh, other country, or maybe from the Japan or from the Germany. They have quite very famous um, automatic park, okay, car. 
So they have some niche in here. Uh, so you can use this area to use the special in Thai Bay port. They have uh, some um, Dong Yen, the this, this center. Uh, so in use this area, you can do some uh, uh, do some uh, uh, to check out your car have some problem or some also in some process to outside. For example, some outside have some our car manufacturing uh, uh, place, and then assemble this kind of weaker to to become the final product to the export to other. Or other place, other territory, or other country. Uh, here is a uh, all leak um, assembly case. Uh, for example, so you can um, to uh, transport from other country or place. So about the complement of uh, all leak and the storage and the here uh, FTC, and then you can uh, dispute uh, to our uh, to other test area. For example, some. Um, belong to the uh, industry park to to do your assembly process and then uh, because the listing areas belong to the tax area and re-export to the our uh, I mean um, to uh, this area Miss Gaussian Port FTC to check out um, um, uh, if this finish good is good or not and then to ship abroad to the other place to other country or other destination Okay, here's about cargo. Uh, because in the Kaohsiung port or in the Kelong port, already got a license of so called RNE. RNE that means uh, London. Uh, London's uh, metro exchange. Uh, so uh, be, become the uh, destination of, uh, uh, of a port. So they can uh, import some this kind of uh, 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 metal. From the our place and the storage this uh, this uh, Gaussian port FTC, and uh, also they can uh, transport to domestic plane or domestic uh, some place special for get an order from the their buyer. So uh, basically, they can use uh, 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 Gaussian port. The Gaussian port they have some uh, RNE warehouse to storage this kind of uh, uh, this kind of final products. And uh, we export to other um, other place or our destination is uh, named by the shipper or consignee. Okay, here it's uh, uh, talking about a maritime spread case because uh, basically, so uh, because uh, our right now e-commerce quite very fast, and also they have uh, some R and D have some collaboration between the mainland China and uh, Taiwan. So in Kaohsiung uh, and the Taipei, they set up the Maritime Express Center. So if you would like to, uh, uh, you, uh, for example, you can use the main train by sea transport to Taipei Port and uh, uh, re-export to, uh, to Damasti or uh, other place. So you can use uh, this area, uh, especially for the MEC, Maritime Express Center, to do your uh, packing and uh, Distribution function. Okay, here is the MCC. MCC quite very news, uh, uh, news uh, business model, including the you can import from Hong Kong, Vietnam, Japan, and use use the area to uh, to do some our uh, assembly or some uh, packing business, and then we export the export to uh, our place. Okay, number four is talking about some our uh, performance of commercial port of FTC. Uh, you can see the trade volumes. Uh, basically, the, the volume number is increasing, right? And uh, but uh, for example, Gaussian port and Taiyuan port is increasing, but the Kilong port there are uh, increasing volume, not so many. Yeah. Okay, you can see this uh, blue color totally is uh, increasing situation. And um, and of course the Taichung port performance quite very good. Here is a show the uh, trade value statistic. Um, normally it's increasing, but you know uh, um, the uh, Taoyuan International Airport their their, their trade value is increasing, and uh, 
on the other side is C poor in their um, increasing increasing their tendency isn't that so ambitious okay compared with the cargo okay thank you or uh, this is a very uh, make a very brief uh, introduction about the uh, uh, free day zone in Taiwan so if you any interesting on this comment please send mail to me thank you very much I'm Charlie Young thank you bye bye